The day started early, in fact, before dawn. Richard, four stages left to go. Are you allowing yourself to think of victory yet? Um, still quite a bit of work to do, but, but obviously I've got my fingers crossed and I'm just going to drive uh, as comfortably as I can. Wedding in his hotel last night, and the karaoke kept him awake. But as long as his engine was running, that was music enough for his ears. These are the conditions that Burns and Robert Reed must overcome if the title is to be theirs. To kill him, find his big hole, keep out. 60, so K right plus. His mechanics had tightened up every nut and bolt on the car. Every setting was at safe, and their fingers were crossed. How painful would these last few cars be? Thirteen years since his first rally, Richard Burns blasts into the final stage of his home event. No chance to make it four wins from four in Britain, but that's a minor consideration when a place in history is at stake. The last agonizing seconds, not just for Burns, but for his fans and his family, waiting at the finish, and also for his team gathered back at the service area. But in true world champion style, Burns cocks a wheel through the last corner of the last kilometer of the last rally of the season to win the 2001 World Rally Championship. You're the best in the world! Richard Burns, 2001 World Rally Champion. How does that sound? Sounds fantastic. Sounds fantastic. Just drove like even worse than my grandma in the last last few kilometres, but it feels fantastic. First marshaled on these stages in 1986. As a child, it must be an amazing feeling. I can't. Well, I can't believe it. I'm sorry, but I've been. Of course, I've been thinking about it today. But how the hell do you can't imagine when you get here? How good it feels. How's it feel being the father of the first ever English World Rally Champion? I, I really don't know. It's just, it's just starting to hit me now. No. You must feel so proud. It's been years, Richard, trying this. Yeah, only, as people say about a dream, you just think it'll never happen. And so it has. <laughs> Robert, you've done it. How does it feel? It feels fantastic. It was difficult in the stage. We just went slowly, but you have to concentrate 100%. So it's only when you cross the finish that it hits you. Fantastic.